Hi, so you just signed up for a roller derby class and you need to get gear. I'm going to show you all the ins and outs of knee pads in this video. All right, so you're shopping online, you're going to your favorite superstore and you find knee pads, right? Um, I don't actually have the knee pads you're going to find at the store, but they're going to look kind of like this. See this profile? And these, and they usually have like a little um, plastic kneecap over it. You um, should not show up to roller derby in, in those pads. You will probably tear a meniscus or break something in these pads because these pads are just padded just enough, just in case you fall. All right, so these are definitely I know your trainer is going to be scared and fearful and probably won't even let you participate in the class if you show up with something like this. All right, so next is second is okay. This is good. This is good for, you know, your first roller derby class. These pads probably cost about $35. Um, and see the profile? There's a little bit more padding there and compare the profile to the first one. This is, there, there is padding here, um, but that profile versus this profile, you, you're going to survive beginner class like this if you do not weigh over 160 pounds, All right? So if you're a lightweight, um, you can survive in these. All right, our next set of pads is getting better. These are um, 187 flies. These also probably cost, um, I think these are like about $45, maybe $55, I'm not sure. Um, but see the profile compared to the, you're gonna be okay if you weigh less than 160 pounds. The profile here and this one. See how it comes out, it's more, solid here. So um, if you're a more solid lady or skater, these will work good for you for beginner class. Um, all right. So, and next, what you really, really, really need are these. See that? This knee pad is going to protect you on the falls. Um, in your beginner class, you're going to be working on falling. That's like usually your first class is all falls and stops and falling is actually a way to stop. So um, this pad compared to this, see, see that protection you get? This pad is gonna protect you. It's gonna feel like a tempur mattress is underneath you um, and falling is going to feel good and invigorating, imagine that. Um, and the, so these, the 187 Pros, 187 Pros is what you need. Um, and there is what I showed you earlier. This is called a 187 Killer, all right? You can get this, but if you want to like actually play and do roller derby, you're gonna need more protection. If you're just um, taking class to learn how to outdoor skate and just, you know, get along without falling, these are fine. These are just in case you fall. Um, also, I'm gonna show you some other pads that are also really good and they've already been tagged. These are like used gear that we're selling. Um, okay, I took it off. Anyways, these are called Smith. These are also good. Smith gear, they come in like little fun patterns. This is the cheetah. They also have purple cheetah, green cheetah. And then they have like your regular, they have regular black as well. But again, see that profile. This is gonna protect you if you decide to, um, you know, expand your roller derby horizon and get on the team or just a scrimmage for fun team. And uh, this will protect you when you're flying through the air and come slamming down on your knee, which happens at least once every scrimmage. So this is not gonna happen every now and then. You are going to be falling, so you need to not skimp on your knee pads. And that's our knee pad video.